Question number one. Why did you become a maintenance technician? The aim of this question is to explore whether the candidate has a passion for maintenance work. What to look for in an answer, passion for maintaining or repairing equipment, enthusiasm, desire to learn or improve skills. Example answer. I became a maintenance technician because I love working on mechanical, electrical, and plumbing systems. While in high school, I made sure all electrical equipment at home functioned properly. I would check my sound systems monthly and repair them when they had issues. After high school, becoming a maintenance technician felt like the right choice for me. I learned how to carry out other maintenance tasks and gained relevant experience in the industry. I am passionate about keeping facilities, tools, and equipment in good working condition. Question number two What experience do you have as a maintenance technician? Maintenance technicians typically need work experience to troubleshoot and resolve technical issues. By asking this question, you can find out what roles an applicant held and what they learned from it. What to look for in an answer. Passion for maintaining facilities, tools, or equipment, desire to learn on the job, lessons learned, or skills acquired in previous roles. Example answer. I worked as a plumber for three years before taking up a role as a maintenance technician in my previous job. As a maintenance technician, I learned how to fix potential hazards and paint buildings. I am eager to apply my experience in your organization and learn new skills. Question number three. As a maintenance technician, what education and training do you have? Maintenance technicians typically have at least a high school diploma and certifications that allow them to use heavy machinery. The goal of this question is to learn whether an applicant has the educational requirements your organization needs. What to look for in an answer. Relevant certifications, desire to learn on the job, communication skills. Example answer. I have a high school diploma and certifications in plumbing, carpentry, and electrical work. Recently, I enrolled for a maintenance training programs in a vocational institute because I believe a good technician is versatile. Question number four. What relevant skills do you think a good maintenance technician has? Maintenance technicians need hard and soft skills to work. A good maintenance technician candidate has personality traits and qualities that align with your organization's culture. This is also a good question if you are looking to fill a position that requires a specific skill set. What to look for in an answer? Manual labor skills, interpersonal skills, physical stamina. Example answer. A good maintenance technician needs some plumbing, electrical, carpentry, and groundskeeping knowledge to work. They should also have excellent interpersonal skills to interact with clients. I am confident that I have these skills and I am eager to use them when maintaining facilities in your organization. Question number five How do you learn about developments in the maintenance industry? Maintenance technicians need to stay current with new technologies and techniques that save time and money. An ideal candidate typically improves their skills through education or training. What to look for in an answer? Proactive attitude, up-to-date industry knowledge, examples of learning activities like a trade magazine subscription or training enrollments. Example answer. I love learning new skills and staying up to date with developments in the maintenance industry. I read journals, newspapers, and research papers. I also go to workshops to network with senior maintenance technicians. I attend conferences and take relevant courses in industrial maintenance to improve up my skills. Question number six How do you manage your time when working on multiple maintenance projects? Depending on your company's grounds and facilities, a maintenance technician may have multiple tasks to complete daily that they need to prioritize according to urgency. 
The goal of this question is to determine whether a candidate can multitask and prioritize tasks. What to look for? Organizational skills, time management skills, ability to work in a fast-paced environment. Example answer. I start my day by creating a list of maintenance tasks I want to complete. Next, I discuss the deadline for each task with my supervisor and order them based on their due dates. I also set personal deadlines that allow me to go over my work, test tools, or equipment, and inspect facilities. I make sure I use efficient maintenance techniques and complete urgent tasks before handling others. Question number 7 How would you present maintenance information to non-technical professionals? The ability to explain maintenance concepts is a skill of a good maintenance technician. This question's purpose is to determine how easily the applicant can summarize complex concepts to non-experts. What to look for in an answer? Effective written and oral communication skills creative thinking ability in-depth understanding of maintenance terms. Example answer. As a maintenance technician, I know I have to work with people from diverse backgrounds and explain various maintenance terms and decisions. I use analogies that non-technical professionals are familiar with and explain maintenance concepts using layperson's terms. Once, I explained how I mowed the lawn by comparing it to a gridiron football field. Question number 8 How important are safety regulations and guidelines to you when performing maintenance tasks? Maintenance technicians need to be safety conscious. By asking this question, you can learn how strongly an applicant feels about safety and whether they commit to following the safety guidelines you set. What to look for in an answer? Understanding of safe procedures, ability to follow instructions, effective communication skill example answer safety is extremely important to me when performing maintenance tasks I make sure I follow the safety guidelines given and review them whenever a task feels unsafe to me I also conduct myself safety and keep the occupational health and safety OHNS standards in mind Question number 9 How do you troubleshoot maintenance issues during checks? Diagnosing a maintenance issue is a vital aspect of a maintenance technician's work. By asking this question, you can find out the technique an applicant uses to troubleshoot a maintenance issue. What to look for in an answer? Effective communication skills, desire to look for solutions, creative thinking and problem-solving skills. Example answer. I use the top-down approach when troubleshooting a maintenance issue. I start by examining the entire system before looking at each component. From my experience, this technique is easier to implement across various maintenance systems and it helps me spot issues quickly. I am open to using other techniques that your organization allows to troubleshoot a maintenance issue. Question number 10 What would you do if you encountered a maintenance issue you could not solve? Maintenance technicians must be familiar with various equipment, tools, and products. The goal of this question is to find out how an applicant would deal with a maintenance issue they couldn't solve and whether they would admit when they need help. Desire to collaborate with other professionals Humility and truthfulness Eagerness to resolve maintenance issues Example answer if I encountered a problem I couldn't solve, I would first inform the client and my supervisor. Next, I would reach out to a senior maintenance technician or my colleague for help. I would notify the client and my supervisor of the response I received from the other professional. Question number 11 Are you available to work flexible hours? Depending on your organization's maintenance needs, maintenance technicians may work flexible hours. The goal of this question is to learn what days and hours an applicant would be available, and how flexible they are around those periods. What to look for in an answer? Experience working flexible hours, 
desire to adapt to an organization's work culture, interpersonal skills. Example question. I am available to work Monday through Friday. I am also flexible about my start and end hours on those days. In my previous role, I worked flexible hours and I have experience putting in long hours. I am also available to work during the weekend and whenever your organization needs to complete urgent maintenance tasks. Question number 12 How would you grade your ability to work in a team? Maintenance technicians may have to work in teams to achieve a shared maintenance goal. This question helps you understand the working style of an applicant and whether they are comfortable working on a team. What to look for in an answer? Attitude towards working in a team, an applicant's working style, interpersonal skills. Example answer. I would grade myself 8 tenths. I work well with maintenance technicians and other maintenance workers in an organization. From my experience, collaborating with others is a good way to learn new concepts and share my ideas. Working with a team can make some tasks easier, meaning I can address more tasks in a day. I feel motivated when working with other maintenance professionals. Question number 13 What would you do if a maintenance manager didn't want to work with you on a project? Working with others can mean that sometimes there are conflicts that need to be resolved quickly and calmly. The goal of this question is to learn how an applicant handles difficult situations and conflicts with other professionals. What to look for in an answer? Interpersonal skills problem solving and conflict resolution skills effective communication and active listening skills. Example question. I would reach out to the maintenance manager to set up a meeting to discuss why they don't want to work with me and how we could come to a resolution. I would suggest solutions on how to handle the situation that wouldn't affect the organization's maintenance targets or goals. Question number 14 Why do you want to work in this organization as a maintenance technician? This question helps you understand whether an applicant is the best fit for your organization. It also helps you determine whether their goals align with your organization's goals. What to look for in an answer? Research skills, desire to contribute to an organization, passion for solving maintenance issues example answer i want to work in this organization because i am looking for challenging opportunities as a maintenance technician i have excellent soft and hard skills to conduct maintenance activities and i am confident my skills would be useful in your organization i am also excited about the opportunities your organization provides to maintenance technicians for career development Question number 15 Describe a situation when you exceeded performance expectations as a maintenance technician. While every organization has maintenance targets, a good applicant seeks to exceed such expectations. By asking this question, you can learn what steps an applicant wants to take to ensure the facilities, equipment, and tools of an organization are in good working condition. What to look for in an answer? desire to solve maintenance issues, problem solving and critical thinking skills, interpersonal and effective communication skills. Example answer. In my previous role, a maintenance manager assigned a painting task to me and I completed it hours before my deadline. While inspecting the painted walls, an idea to mow the lawn came to my mind, and I found a lawn mower in the shed. The maintenance manager and client were happy with my decision to maintain the lawn. Thank you for watching our video and please like, comment and subscribe below.